right, here we go. Day two in D.C. The weather is a lot better today. This is Sunday. Uh, the Kite Festival is today. It looks beautiful out today. There's no clouds. There's like literally not a single cloud. Uh, temperature's probably about 40 something. It's supposed to get up to close to 60 today. And that's the weather report. Let's take a look at the city. That is, is the wharf right over here. I've actually uh, rode my one way along here. Wharf's down that way. There's a Shake Shack. This is going to come up along the parkway. Along the way. That's uh, Lincoln Memorial over to the left. Well, here's some information I found out about the Bloom Kite Festival. Formerly, it was called the Smithsonian Kite Festival. It's an annual kite event. It's usually held on the National Mall in Washington, D.C. late March during the National Cherry Blossom Festival. This has been going on since 1967. They did take a couple years off due to the pandemic, so there was they didn't have it in 2020, 2021. It was back in 2022, and I had the opportunity to go in 2023. I just wanted to see it. I had seen different pictures, and I just wanted to be there to experience it myself. And it was amazing. It was just a beautiful day. The festival was founded in 1967 by the aviation pioneer Paul E. Garp, who was actually the first curator of the National Air and Space Museum until 2010. That's how the Smithsonian originally was associated with it. Now it's sponsored by Amazon. So it's not only did you get a chance to fly kites next to the Washington Monument, they also have people that are there to help you with your kites. There's all kinds of demonstrations, choreographed performances, all kinds of different things. It was so much fun. I had to get involved and I bought myself a kite. I didn't even fly it. I just wanted to buy a kite. It, it looks like everybody was having so much fun flying kites. All right, so we're getting a kite. We're gonna buy ourselves a kite. I didn't really plan on buying a kite, but it's a kite festival. Get a kite. And individual performers for your kite ballet, please make sure you have all that information to the sound tent. In 2024, the Kite Festival will be taking place on Saturday, March 30th. And if it rains on that day, they're gonna have it on March 31st. So if you're in the area and you're interested in it, I would definitely say check it out. It's a lot of fun. So do you like flying kites? Have you ever flown a kite? I, I used to fly kites so much when I was little. You know, have you ever been to Washington, D.C.? Have you ever seen the Cherry Blossom Festival? In DC, it was something to be witnessed for me. And hey, do me a favor, hit that like button. And if it's your first time here, you're not already subscribed, please subscribe. It helps out the channel a lot and I really do appreciate it. And until next video, remember, take care of each other, peace out, and I will see you all soon.